Well, Lake Elmo Teen is in the ICU with severe chemical burns after a tragic crash in Illinois last week. Authorities say that a jackknife tanker truck released toxic ammonia into the air, killing five people and injuring several others. Fox 9's Rose Schmidt spoke with the teen's family and joins us in our newsroom. Rose? Yeah, four college students from the University of Missouri were in a car behind that tanker when it overturned. One of them is 18-year-old Sarah Taig, a Lake Elmo native and recent graduate of Stillwater Area High School. She was really looking forward to going to school there. Sarah Tague had just started to find her place as a freshman at the University of Missouri, studying biochemical engineering and joining Mizzou Club Swim. She's such a chill kid, very funny, sarcastic, willing to do anything and help you out. Her aunt, Brandy Van Gunst, says on Friday, Sarah and three teammates were driving through central Illinois on their way to a swim meet at Ohio State when the tanker truck in front of them crashed. Authorities say leaking 4,000 gallons of toxic chemicals. This accident caused a large uh, plume cloud of anhydrous ammonia on the roadway. Sarah and her friends ran from the car as far as they could. Hours later, her parents got the call saying she was life flighted to Springfield, Illinois, about 90 miles away from the scene. Figuring out where, where they were, what condition was she was in, because they, they didn't know anything. Um, so that, I think, is any person's worst nightmare. The exposure to anhydrous ammonia, which is mostly used for agriculture or refrigeration, caused severe chemical burns that left the college swimmers with swelling and irritation to their lungs, eyes, and skin. Sarah is still in the ICU, but making little improvements every day with her family by her side. Life can change in literally an instant. You know, futures can change in a matter of seconds. And, you know, to enjoy each day and really don't take anything for granted. Sarah's family and Mizzou Club Swim have set up GoFundMes to help with medical and hotel expenses. Kelsey? All right, thank you, Rose. Tonight.